Chateau sur Mer is one of the first Grand Bellevue Avenue mansions of the Gilded Age in Newport, Rhode Island. It was completed in 1852, somewhat earlier than the other mansions built in Newport. It was built as an Italianate villa for William Shepherd Wetmore, a merchant in the old China trade. And the structure is a landmark of Victorian architecture and constructed of Fall River granite. William Wetmore died on June 16, 1862, leaving the bulk of his fortune to his son, George Peabody Wetmore. During the 1870s, the Wetmores departed on an extended trip to Europe leaving architect Richard Morris Hunt to remodel and redecorate the house in French Second Empire style. This is the new entrance and stairwell designed by architect Richard Hunt. The marble hall originally served as the mansion's main entrance. It was closed off in 1920 by replacing the door with a bay window shown here behind the statue. The marble room then became a gallery for the Wetmore's collection of objets d'art. The centerpiece of the mansion's interior is its great hall, a massive three-story chamber with a 45-foot ceiling and broad balconades. The billiard room is in the East Lake style with oak timbers aligned diagonally on the ceiling and herringbone flooring. The library has an Italianate design and was actually designed and built in Italy and then dismantled and transported to Newport. The green room served as a ladies reception area and was designed in 1900 by Ogden Codman Jr. in the Louis XV style. The ballroom is decorated with crystal chandeliers and fine plaster. The room is one of the few that remained relatively unaltered by architect Hunt's work. The dining room is in Renaissance Revival style and was also built in Italy.
This is Mr. Wetmore's bedroom and dressing area. This is Mrs. Wetmore's large master suite, which includes her large bedroom shown here. Mrs. Wetmore's dressing room and boudoir shown here. And her marble bathroom. This is the cottage used by the Wetmore's butler. This is Miss Edith Wetmore's butler and Miss Wetmore herself. Chateau sur Mer was one of the few Newport cottages built as a year-round residence, unlike most of the others built during this period because the Wetmores were a New England family who made Newport their home.